Hey guys, we're here today at California Adventure. We're just gonna have a nice fun day, doing fun stuff. You know, we'll see what kind of trouble we get into. We don't really have a plan. First up, we're gonna go get a fuel rod and then we're gonna go to Toy Story. Here's a fuel rod, guys. I'm just exchanging mine. If you've never seen one before, you can buy one for $30 and then you can replace it as many times as you want. It's just a one-time charge. I'm just putting it in. A new one should pop out. And there you go, new battery. They're really great. And we were on our way and we saw the car, the new Cars Line sign that says Welcome Cruz Ramirez. That's pretty cool that there's a new sign that welcomes her. I think that's the first time they've done that since Cars Line is open. They do it for Christmas actually. But other than that, pretty neat. We made it to Toy Story Midway Mania. Oh, fast passes. New fast passes are available. Over here. Okay. My first, hello. My first Toy Story Mania fast pass. First Midway Mania Toy Story fast pass. Now while we wait for our fast pass for Toy Story, we're gonna head over to Cars and do single rider on Radiator Springs Racers. Here we go into Cars Land. For anybody that doesn't know, if you come in through the wharf back here, this is actually my favorite way to enter Cars Land because not only is it nice and quiet, but you have these beautiful vistas. Look at that. So you get to see the cars coming over the hill. Perfect timing. It's beautiful. A little secret for Radiator Springs. You see up there, the wait is 105 minutes, but we're gonna head to the single rider. And the nice thing about the single rider is that you also have a chance to ride against your friends. It's the only way you can actually ride against your friends is if you ask to be separated like that or you do single rider. So we're gonna do that. Exactly what I'm talking about. Sometimes you do single rider, you can uh, ride against your friends rather than with them. It's more fun that way. So I may have lost to Katrina, but uh, I'll get the next one, Katrina. I'll get the next one. Stay positive. Ah, that's right. <laughs> On our way to Toy Story, we ran into Cruz Ramirez herself. There she is, visiting guests over here in California Adventure. She doesn't even have a very long line, so 
Exactly. <laughs> it's all right. I like your angels. It sounds great. The coat bar is not even open yet. And there's already a big line of people ready for lobster nachos. Okay, so here it is. You use your annual pass. You use your annual pass. You scan it. It has a light, it's green. We're good. Good for fast pass. Oh, Mr. Potato Head just went to sleep. Good night, sweet prince. And just like in Disney World, you do need to scan your pass twice. Here we go. Green, we're good. It seems like the new Fast Pass kind of does take some time to scan everything. Especially when you have a big group of people. Ooh, guys, I'm the green gun. Katrina's the yellow gun. She's going down. <laughs> yes! Yes! We're all winners! We're all winners! Now we're headed over to Jumpin' Jellyfish. It's a, it's a little kid's ride, yeah. But hey, I enjoy it, don't judge. We are the fighting army. We are the fighting army green. One of the little secrets of Jumpin' Jellyfish is to try and sit on that side so that you get a nice little view of the Ferris wheel, world of color. Oh my gosh, we got the good side with the view. What a beautiful view. Nothing beats this Oh my goodness. And we slowly drop. This would actually be kind of a scary ride if it was just a little faster. All the rides are gone off at once. And it's over. Oh no, one more? Aha. Uh -huh. Up next, Golden Zephyr. I don't know why they call it a Golden Zephyr when it's actually silver. Golden Zephyr. Welcome aboard, Flyboys and Sky Gals. It's a great ride to go on when you're not sure what else to do. There's not many people in the park and there's no wait. Alright guys, we have a reservation now at Carte Circle for 1.30, so we're gonna go grab some lunch over there, but first have a few drinks in the lounge. Change of plans. We don't even have drinks, we're just gonna get seated. They have space for us. Yeah. <laughs> Carte Circle. Oh. Beverages have arrived, guys. I got a Carte sidecar. It has Hennessy and lemon juice in it. It's really good. And Richard and Caroline got the Carte Manhattan with the little ice sphere. All right, we just got lunch at Carte Circle. I forgot to show you guys my burger. It was pretty good. My friend Richard here, he got a burger too. What'd you think of the burger? 
I thought it was really good. I didn't realize how big it was gonna be, but it was huge and delicious. It's gigantic. It's like $20 burger, but it's kind of worth it. What did you get, Carolyn? Oh man, what did I get? What did I get? The shrimp gorditas, <laughs> oh, yeah. right? Yeah, I got that. It was good. It was really good. good. I got the roasted chicken salad. It was a little small, but actually the flavors were on point. It was like sweet and salty. It was really, really good, worth the, worth the money. Yeah, so there you go, Carte Circle lunch. We had some drinks, we had some food. We're gonna head probably to Trader Sam's now for a little bit more drinks. <laughs> See you guys soon. If you guys look for this building and come in here, there's a little Easter egg that I wanted to point out. Up here on this mailbox, the mailbox of Eddie Valiant from Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Trader Sam's Enchanted Tiki Bar. What'd you get, Katrina? I got the Hippopotamus Mai Tai. That's like the only thing that I love here. Oh, well, not the only thing. The uh oh. But they don't have the glasses right now. They're so out they of the glasses. They can't. We can't have an uh oh. So. That's right. Stuff like that. I got one of those two hip part of mine tie. What'd you get, Richard? I got the uh, zombie head, which uh, describes me. This heat, it's brutal. <laughs> it's hot out. <laughs> What'd you get, Carolyn? Uh, the mosquito mojito. What do you think? Good. You know, mojito's the best summer drink. Nice and minty. It is. Refreshing. Right. Refreshing. All right, guys. We're done over at Trader Sam's. Walking back through downtown Disney. I think we're gonna head to the playground over in California Adventure. It's like a brother bear thing. Ah, we're coming upon the Redwood Creek Challenge Trail. They still have some brother bear theming out there. Ooh, listen to that beautiful music. Here along the trail, you can find a lot of tracks of animals, including Kevin from Up. That's crazy. What are you doing here, Kevin? Here are some tracks along the trail. Hey, what are you doing up there? Hey guys, how's it going? What's up? There's a cool little rock wall here. You start here, work your way around. Get to the finish line. There's this whole network of nets for everyone to play in at the Eagle's Ascent. The Wick Wick Hawk. I don't think I've ever noticed this before. Have you? No. I've never seen this before. There's money in there. You see the money at the Wick Wick Hawk? People have been throwing money in there. In this area, you get to find out what your spirit animal is by pressing your hand against the wall. Oh my goodness. I'm a wolf. A wolf. Now it's my turn to figure out my spirit animal. It's a nice little beaver. Okay. What could Richard's spirit animal be? Go, Richard. Uh, oh, I'm totally a <laughs> The majestic yeah. moose. 100%, 100%. The majestic moose. No, no. And here's a list of all the animals that you can find in the cave and it shows you all the traits that come with it. Just in case you were wondering exactly what was entailed for your spirit animal. Sometimes you're nearing the end of the day, you just need to get a little bugs land in your system. Get that Heimlich's choo-choo train. And bugs land has a new neighbor and it sure looks a lot different. It's kind of weird. Look at that happy little Heimlich. This apple tastes just like apple strudel. Only this house is strudel. <laughs> Dripping water. Water. It's 
It actually smells like animal crackers. I just love treats and sweets. Second, oh, my favorite candy corn. Oh, All right, guys. Well, that turned out to be the last ride of the day. I love that Heimlich Choo Choo train. It always cracks me up. So I love the smells. There's some water from the watermelon. It's actually a pretty fun ride for like a little kid's thing. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the day. Keep watching the Diz and come on back.